Hello everyone, this is Tim Zai. Today I'm gonna talk about ecosystem production in lakes. So first of all, let's see the condition of lakes in the world. Lakes, this is a picture of the lake distribution in the world. Lakes occupy only a small percentage of Earth's total surface area. About the total surface area of lakes about 42 million kilometer square, only about 2.8 percentage of the planet's land surface area, or less than one percentage of the Earth's total surface area. Lakes of all sides are in an important area of biologic study. Because while only only make a small contribution to the total surface of the planet, they proportionally make a much larger contribution to ecologic e ecologic process such as carbon cycling and the biodiversity compared to other environments. So, what is energy production? Well discuss two words. One is gross primary production, which means how much carbon we produced in the photosynthesis, which is use the carbon dioxide and uh, light energy to produce the oxygen and the carbon hydrate. Well, another word is net primary production. It is the GPP decrease respiration when the planets to used in the photosynthesis. So, what's the primary producer in the lakes? They are plankton, perif and the macrophages and also there are others so other the primary producer in the lakes are plankton, prefton and the microphytes which is large rooted aquatic plants while other Producers such as photosynthetic and the chemosynthetic bacterial algae with other organisms may be present. They are usually minor contributors to the system's total primary production in the lake. The relevant importance of the plankton, perif and the microfeeds contributions to the total primary production depends on basin micro basin morphology, water clarity, substrate suitability, and the extent of the water level fraction. For example, if water is turbulent, it's hard for the microfeeds to rotate. So the most part of the photosynthesis is be done by the plankton. That's the picture of the plankton such scenes. So what factors controlling the producer? As other environment it's light temperature and the nutrients but as the nutrients most abundant in lakes like nitrogen, phosphorus and dissolved oxygen. So most is determined by the light and temperature. While the lake is a special ecosystem determined by the depth, depth each that level have different light and uh, temperature difference. So the most of the photosynthesis occurs on the surface of the lake. 
what else uh, is relative about the production of the lake is the color the blue lake green lake and brown lake blue lake is low concentration of algae so it's low productivity while the green has high concentration of algae but it's not always a good thing and at the same time it has high productivity the brown lake is high amounts of dissolved organic matter so it will look like brown and light is limited because it's brown at the same time some algae have to adapt to the low light so that's all i want to talk about today and here is my citation thanks for watching